Probably the, the most poignant uh, picture of the whole evening, really, is Tommy. Um, on 1st of September 2004, uh, in the Grand Prix, Tom achieved 120 miles an hour from a standing start. Uh, and on the last lap, he was involved in an accident at Balaf. Um, and he succumbed to his injuries later on that evening. Uh, Tom was only 36. Um, his, he wasn't an out-and-out -out striker, but his, his average of one every two goal every two games, which I know, 428 appearances and 213 goals, virtually one in two. Uh, and he was a great, great character and a great inspiration. Um, I do remember the time that, that he had got himself injured. He paid for himself to, to, with a personal loan from the bank to get his, himself sorted out. Uh, and he also abstained from, from beer for a long time to ensure he was fit. That was how, how keen um, he was for the game and uh, obviously much missed uh, as a, a road named after him here. Um, but more importantly, on to the next slide, um, many, many involved in, uh, in the, the family, but as well people like Neil Kane. Kelvin Dawson, uh, Graham Gale, but many, many of us were instrumental in raising funds to provide a, a permanent memorial for Tommy, which is the, the sports hall uh, at the ground. And that was opened nine years to the day after his, his, his uh, passing uh, and is, is well used by uh, many from within the town, but also from many from outside the town. It is a real community um, set up there so uh, well done to everybody for and for their ongoing work uh, in, in maintaining it as well.